Colin Gregor. Age? Uh, 33. Nationality? Scottish. Um, position? Scrum half or fly half. Uh, and number of international uh, series caps? Libya! Uh, 50 on the IRB World Series, 3 World Cups and 2 Commonwealth Games. Good knowledge. I started playing rugby when I was in about primary five, so I think I was ten or eleven, something like that. Uh, earliest memory was probably refusing to get out of the car at training because I didn't want to go and my dad forcing me out onto the pitch, which uh, is probably a good thing that he did because I eventually like, started enjoying it and uh, here I am today. Good, good one for all the youngsters out there. Yeah. Uh, I brought to the weekend the uh, Obviously the, the results, especially on Sunday, didn't go as we would have liked, but the, the atmosphere um, at Ibrox was incredible to be, to be part of a, a home Commonwealth Games and to play in front of that crowd was, was really special. Uh, as a kid I always liked Diego Maradona because he was small and very skillful <laughs> and I like to think of myself along those sort of lines. Yeah. Um, also got a lot of respect for, for people like Michael Johnson and Michael Jordan, um, just real, real high quality athletes. I'd probably go with football, just uh, played a lot of it as a kid, still like to, to kick a ball around, it's just I'm not very good at it, so I uh, had to take up rugby instead. <laughs> Fair enough. On day one we certainly were, we'd, we were ran New Zealand really close, it would have been nice if we'd, we'd had an extra minute on the clock and managed to get a victory over them, but Canada was always going to be the crunch game and we, we played really well in that game, made sure we were in the cup quarter finals where we came up against South Africa and a little bit disappointed with how we went there but you've got to give them respect or credit as well because they put in a really strong performance and the England game at the end we were we were gutted to lose that because we wanted to give the, the fans something to cheer end the, end the tournament on a high but uh, it wasn't to be so yeah it was a great experience a wee bit disappointed overall. Way better. Yeah. I always thought Hong Kong and Dubai, places like that, were, were pretty special. But um, 45,000 screaming Scotsmen, it, it was unbelievable when they were singing uh, the Proclaimers at half time and trying to chat in our little huddle in the middle of the pitch and you couldn't hear each other. It was just, uh, it truly really was special. Going to a lot of different sports, seen a bit of hockey, um, been in at the boxing, going to the boxing again just now. Had a really enjoyable afternoon at the gymnastics actually, it's amazing watching them live just to see how impressive they are, how strong, flexible, um, coordinated everything, so enjoyed a lot of different sports, yeah. Metal ketchup or brown sauce? Ketchup. City slicker or country bumpkin? City slicker. Twitter or Facebook? Twitter. Brain or brawn? Brain. Radio 1 or Radio 2? 2. Full <laughs> Scottish or Continental? Uh, continental. Tea or coffee? Tea. Bolt or Farah? <laughs> Jog or gym? Gym. Early morning or late night? Early morning. Scarlett Johansson or Tina Knightley? Scarlett. Thriller or comedy? Protein shake or milkshake? Protein. Resort holiday or cultural visit? Cultural visit. Uh, cinema or DVD? DVD. Carter or Wilkinson? Carter. Serevi or Forbes? Serevi. And an inspirational speech or lead by example? Lead by example. Sweet. Well done mate.